a 15-year-old schoolboy made a big splash in the field of neuroscience. Kritan Nithyananda is a 15-year-old Indian origin boy in the UK. Kritan moved to Britain from India with his family when he was a baby. Kritan attends Sutton Grammar School. He represents Surrey in squash, and a member of St. John's Ambulance Cadets and is working towards his Silver Duke of Edinburgh Award. His father is an IT consultant and mother is a teaching assistant. Kritan, who suffered from hearing problems as a child, wants to study medicine when he leaves school. Kritan has invented a test for Alzheimer's disease, by which it can be diagnosed 10 years before the first symptoms appear. Currently Alzheimer's can only be detected through a series of cognitive tests or by post-mortem examination of the brain. Kritan has developed a Trojan horse antibody which can penetrate the brain and attach to neurotoxic proteins which are present in the very first stages of the disease. The antibody, attached to fluorescent particles is injected into the bloodstream can be picked up on a brain scan. A diagnostic probe developed by Kritan can be used to image Alzheimer's disease non-invasively. This early diagnosis can help families to prepare for the future and then take steps to prevent or delay the onset. Neurodegenerative disease like dementia are so hard to diagnose and treat because of the blood-brain barrier. Blood-brain barrier is an extra layer of cellular material which surrounds the blood vessels of the brain, and refuses to let anything foreign through that, and is absolutely essential. But Critton's antibodies can pass through that barrier. Latest lab tests even show that they handcuff the toxic proteins, stopping them from developing further which can potentially stop progression of Alzheimer's in its tracks. Alzheimer's disease kills more people each year than breast and prostate cancer combined. Alzheimer's is also considered to be one of the greatest medical challenges of the 21st century. 225,000 people develop dementia every year, that's roughly one person every three minutes. Of which Alzheimer's disease being the most common type. Some of Critton's new preliminary research has suggested that his diagnostic probe can simultaneously have therapeutic potential as well as diagnostic. Critton said I chose Alzheimer's disease because I am fascinated by neuroscience and the workings of the brain. I learned about its cruel and devastating effects and how it interferes with everyday life, and nobody should have to live with this debilitating disease. I have personally seen what a difference it can make to people's lives and I want to make a difference to the lives of others. Young people like Kritan Nithyanande often has the creative ability to solve some of the world's greatest challenges. They have real potential to impact people's lives one day in the future. My congratulations to Kritan Nithyananda and I wish him every success as on his future program. I love someone fighting Alzheimer's thank you.